All right. Well, then let's uh, let's move on to um, something you were kind of more you brought up to me um, was the no reporters um, kind of ste- into the in the clubhouse stemming from this coronavirus going around. Yeah. In case uh, people haven't heard out there, apparently there's this virus that's taken over the news and they're the ones touching their face and spreading <laughs> this thing. Yeah, it's the reporters getting up in the in the people's faces, just touching them. Um, it, it's look, players have wanted distance from reporters for a long time, and one of the great things about baseball has been the close interaction with reporters. Um, it, it helps again the business side of baseball uh, getting different, you know, viewpoints and stuff. And uh, I just think it's wrong. Uh, like, what's a reporter gonna do? What what contact does does a reporter like go to, go to the airport and like rub down on people from Wuhan as they're coming back? No, they're just you know they're at the field at the clubhouse. They're not sitting in the stands for the most part, like in the middle of big stuff. They're in the camera well or something like that. I think this stuff is just getting blown out of proportion. The whole thing with with uh, coronavirus is getting blown out of proportion and this is one of the things and i hate to see as soon as the clubhouses the ownership or you know management could separate the players from the reporters they're taking advantage of it and it's wrong yeah so personally i like all i i agree i mean it's good for baseball but i like seeing the stuff from the players i like their interviews you know yeah and they just i don't know the 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 teams have to just keep an open dialogue because that's really what the fans get. If not, you know, you get more insular insulated, uh, from, from everything. Yeah. So, uh, 